seven. Warner over the middle and open. He's bruised. Does he make the catch? He does at the 49-yard line. Sliding with the AstroTurf covered by Roll. First down, Rams. Remember, Jeff Fisher told us this week, Al, that he wanted to make sure that third down was not the key down for the offense of the Rams. It seems like that Kurt Warner gets better as the downs go further on in the nice catch by Isaac Cruz, but he gets for Del Greco's missed field goal attempt to begin from there, and Warner slings it over the middle and wide open is Torrey Holt, the wide receiver, all the way to the Tennessee 30-yard line. The rookie out of North Carolina State, sixth guy picked in the draft, 32 yards. When you watch Kurt Warner drop back out, he just plants his foot and he delivers a strike, and this is really a tremendous throw and play by Kurt Warner. It's easy, it's open. We were talking to Al Saunders, the wide receiver coach. He told me before the game, watch for this guy, Torrey Holt. He's quick, he's fast, and it's a great matchup for the Rams against the Titans. The order of Rodney Thomas. Now the Rams have made very little out of three drives for the red zone because this drive with Isaac Bruce making the catch and picking up 11 yards. That's a first down. Nine twenty to go on the half and we go. Titans on a stunt up front, but it's picked up, and then the pass is hauled in by Torrey Holt for a first down. In point, just beautiful. I go back to the beginning of the game when Mike Barnes was telling me prior to the game that Torrey Holt was going to have a huge game, and he saw something in the films that would allow him to say that, and he saw mismatches, and certainly Torrey Holt and the Rams, the most difficult thing to do against them is to match up against their three and four wide receiver packages. Because he, and he it. it was also not reviewable because he was down by contact. So it's moved on all counts as Warner throws, and Holt makes the catch up at the 48-yard line, and that's a very close to a first down it is. So here comes number 30 right now. Warner throws, and that is caught by Isaac Bruce, covered by Sidney. That'll move the chains. The Rams marching again. The Rams. Now they're outside because of the penalty. And on first and 20, it is juggled, and it is caught by Holt at the 20-yard line. Movie type of guy. First down, Warner slings it deep in the seam, wide open. Isaac Bruce to the chorus of Bruce to the 26. Great thing about this particular play for Isaac Bruce, he gets down into the seam, and instead of running through the seam, he sits down in the zone. And this is why quarterbacks like Kurt Warner can throw confidently because he knows that his receiver sees where he is. Watch him slow down right here. He slows down and catches the ball before he reaches the second safety. Where are they from the watch? Three receivers to the right. Warner goes over the middle. Juggled, caught. Oh, touchdown. up there he sees that he has Torrey Holt one-on-one -on, -one on Sydney and look at that move off the line of scrimmage and this guy's a rookie to be able to do that in the biggest game of his career and to give this guy Kurt Warner the free shot to throw the football in there you can see how these guys are tooled for the future mm -hmm. last two drives for the Rams three and out huge first half for Warner less than a mediocre second half Georgia Frontier Mark Pounding 27-yard line, Warner to throw. Going deep downfield, adjusting for it is Isaac Bruce. And Isaac Bruce threads his way for a touchdown. 73 yards. You couldn't have written a better script for the MVP of the league. He throws a beautiful pass in the face of pressure. And, and Isaac Cruz comes up with a huge play over Denard Walker. Gets inside him, goes through the maze. Now that movie continues.